Before I start this video, I just want to let you guys know that God has not forgotten about you. Whether you're going through a heartbreak, a bad relationship, issues with your family, maybe you're in college or even high school and you're struggling right now with your grades or trying to figure out what you exactly want to do with your life, or maybe you just have issues financially, or maybe you're just not in a place that you really feel like you're happy at, just know that God has not forgotten about you. When you put your worries, your anxieties, and all those issues in God's hands, He will work wonders with them. He wants us to have faith. And he wants us to know and trust him and know that he will make things amazing. He will turn your bad situation and make it good again or make it 10 times better. You might think right now you're just going through the worst time of your life, but God uses bad times and bad things that go on to strengthen us, to strengthen our faith. He wants to see that, are you really going to believe in me? Are you really going to keep having faith in me that I will get your life back on track and make your life a ton better if you just seek me so just seek God and no matter what you do do not think that he forgot about you and you will see amazing things happen in your life when you trust God don't ever give up don't ever think that life is too hard because at the end of the day sweetheart you are going to make it through so much with God on your side don't ever give up because you are beautiful you are amazing you are a strong woman and nothing and no one can take that away when God has on your life if God has his hand on your life no one can take it that away no one can take your blessings away no one can take your strength away have faith in him he will see you through don't count on anyone count on him to get you through all your heartache and you need to believe not only in him but in yourself that you are a strong woman and that with God you can do anything and I hope that this helped you guys out there and I hope that this made someone happy and made someone smile and God bless you guys and let me get into this amazing hair video you like a love song in my mind play it all little baby one more time so hey guys, this is your girl Jasmine Yvonne and I'm coming to you guys today to do my install review for my Luscious Hair. I want to say Luscious so bad, but I think it's Luscious, so we're just going to go with Luscious. So they sent me two 24 inches, a 26 inch and a 28 inch and an 18 inch closure and I believe this hair is Brazilian straight hair. If I'm wrong, I will fix it, but I believe that is Brazilian straight hair. I did an unboxing video. One thing I want to touch on real quick in this video though is that when I did the unboxing video, I did not know how long their shipping took. I assumed uh, it would take maybe a week or a little longer because I just did not know. But they emailed me and they let me know that it takes three to five days. So just in case you guys were wondering, that's how long shipping takes if you guys did watch the unboxing video or if you guys are going to go back and watch it real quick. That's just something FYI. So I'm going to get right into this review. Um, I've had this hair installed, um, I would say coming on three weeks. I've had this hair installed faithfully and I've been wearing it pretty much faithfully since then, since I made this unit. I really like this hair um, for the most part. I like it because for one, it holds a curl. I don't think I've curled my hair in the last, I don't think I curled it yesterday before I had school. Actually, I didn't curl it out. Actually, no. I didn't curl my hair yesterday and I didn't curl it today. I literally just brushed it out and this is how it looks so it holds a curl really 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 well I do recommend however though that you get like a soft hold hairspray or if you don't have a soft hold hairspray make sure that you just spray like a little bit and then you kind of brush it out because hairspray can help your hair stay holding longer um, especially if you're someone like me who lives in a state where it gets kind of misty or can be kind of humid as from time to time that can be a lifesaver for your hair dude that's one thing I like about this hair. Another thing I like about this hair is that it keeps its luster. As you can see, it looks really healthy and really shiny. I haven't washed this hair like every week or twice a week. I haven't been doing that at all. Um, there are even times that I sleep in this wig or there's times that I might be really tired if I don't have the wig sewn on. I might like throw this wig on the floor. I'm not even going to lie to you guys, which is really bad. I'm just, sometimes I'm just that tired. I'm just like, whoop pop this sucker off and I'm about to go to bed so I'm just gonna be honest with you guys I don't always just put my wig on like a nice wig stand and it's like sitting there all pretty no I'm sorry I don't have wig stands I have one wig head and it kind of scares me sometimes when I put it on my wig head and he's and she's like looking at me so I just sometimes just throw it around in my room and even when I do that, I might wake up and the hair might be a little tangled or whatever and then all I do is brush it out and it's like magic. It goes right back to looking really beautiful and really flawless, which is something that I really, really do adore about this hair. Um, so that's something I'm happy about. It also is true to leave. Um which is good it hasn't like thinned out really bad on me or anything like that so I like it as well it's also pretty full even though it is four bundles I did not use all 
full full bundles of hair and it's still pretty pretty full which I really like as well so for the most part I really do enjoy this hair and I really do like this hair a lot as far as how it looks as far as how it feels it is still soft um which is a really good thing again even if I don't like treat the wig so proper and prim it's still really soft and it still looks really really good so those are some things that I really adore about this hair so as far as the cons of this hair, I would have to say that this hair does shed a good little bit when I do brush it out. I will find hair just kind of dangling at the end I have to prick off. Or if I'm laying down, I'll find hair or I'll find hair all on my clothes. I go to my boyfriend's house and he has hair. This is probably him too. He just probably texted me. Yeah, he just texted me asking me did I post videos. I would if you don't text me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. But yeah, so like... I'll be at my boyfriend's house, uh, we're like chilling and for some odd reason like he has dreads so if I have hair and his dreads like literally we're just sitting there like watching a movie, why Why are you in his dreads hair? So like he'll like find a piece and he'll like oh this, this is yours like well sometimes it's so, it's so funny like he'll have hair and I'll find like a piece of his dread on me like a piece of hair that came from his dreads and he'll find a piece of hair on him it's just really funny but yeah so it does shed a good little bit it's not to the point where it's globs of hair and I always say that because shedding is gonna happen when you have hair it's gonna shed sometimes maybe sometimes it's not that much maybe sometimes it's a little bit more like if you're wearing something you have to prick it off you or maybe you're out somewhere and you're like doing something and like a piece of hair falls like at the store or something it can be kind of awkward and it can for some people be very frustrating to me I'm used to it just because I've had so many different hair companies that some hair sheds some hair doesn't so I'm kind of more chill with it as far as like I don't freak out I'm like oh, I hate this hair like I'm not like that but it does kind of frustrate me just a little bit because like it is awkward when you're with your boyfriend like you have a long piece of weave that's stuck on him or stuck on your clothes or maybe you're about to pay someone money at the store and like a piece of hair is like stuck on the money you're like oh let me get that back so that is a con that I did know about this hair. I don't really like hair that sheds more than minimum. Um, but this hair is so pretty and looks so good that I kind of just, I've been dealing with it. And I kind of just like, it. it's not that big of a problem to me just because the hair hasn't thinned out on me, hasn't lost its length, and it looks really, really good. Another con I have with this hair is that it, um, what's another con with this hair? <laughs> uh... I don't know. <laughs> I think that's it. I think that's the only con with this hair is that it just sheds. Um, I don't really get too much tangling. I do get a little bit of tangling, but it's very minimum. The most tangling I get with this hair is just when I don't uh, put it in like a nice spot, like brush it out and then like sit it somewhere nice in my room. Like when I just throw it on the floor or I just sleep with it like really wildly, it will get tangled. But once you brush it out, that hair is like right back to normal. So I feel like if you're someone who wears bonnets all the time, wrap your hair every night, you will not really deal with that. But if you're someone like me who sometimes you're really lazy and you go to sleep, you might get tangling. But once you brush it out, this hair will go right back to normal as you can see like with my hair right now. But for the most part, those are my only two issues and they're very minimal issues to me because this hair looks really, really flawless and really, really good. I did not sell my web so that probably will help a lot of people out if they do experience shedding with this hair to sell their webs. Um, so I really recommend that you guys do that with your hair. And yeah, so um, those are my only two issues. But for the most part, I really do like this hair. I think this hair is really good quality. I do not plan on um, bleaching this hair or anything like that. So anyone who's wondering. And uh, again, I haven't washed this hair like a ton of times. I don't think I washed this hair at all actually so and it looks really good still so um, I do highly highly recommend this hair I think this hair company has really good quality hair make sure that you follow them on the Instagram make sure that you um, check out their website as well make sure you check all that stuff down below and if you guys forgot the link or inches or anything like that all that will be in the description box and again thank you guys so much for watching and I hope that you guys have a good day bye